Good morning, hungry homies. It's show day. So we are awake. It is 5.15 in the morning. I have already taken pictures for coach. Um, I have been given the plan. So we're gonna follow that plan. Um, I've had four ounces of coffee. Um, that's just like a necessity. I need to have the coffee in the morning. So coffee, I got this, um, I found it in Tampa. It's like this instant coffee, but it's like a yellow label. It's like a Latin. It's really good, good tasting instant coffee. So I've had that. Um, I will eat in about 15 minutes or so. Um, and then shortly after, like 45 minutes after, I will take pictures for coach. And then I'm gonna head to the venue, um, which is like six minute drive away to go get my first coat of tan. And then once that's done, um, then I'll come back here, then back to the venue in a couple hours for athlete meeting and check-in. And then I'm gonna stay there and then do second coat of tan and my makeup, then come back to the hotel and then snooze for a bit and then final start at 5 p.m. So follow along, we're gonna have some fun today. Looking dicey. Right, please forgive me, my station is very messy right now. So I have my egg whites. Um, I'm doing a little bit less than what he asked because at this point right now, the protein isn't like, it's just sitting really heavy in my stomach. So he wanted a cup. I'm doing just three egg whites rather than like, he's like six. So it's half the amount, but that's okay. And then I've got English muffin here. Just kidding, I wanna do this thing. And we do get to add salt today. Salt. Oh, this is the coffee. Bustelo. It's good. It is a product of Mexico. That's why I like it. Proper, proper coffee. None of this Folgers crap. Oh, I did my nails last night. So these are the Glamnetics again. They're pretty good, eh? Warm those guys up. There we go, guys. first meal and then I'll take pictures for coach and I'll show you. Pami on your next song, turn the lights off, tell me where you want it. Baby, you're the one I want to know about. We can fall in slowly, yeah. We don't need to do the talking. Get into it, baby, softly, yeah. Man, on and on, cause I'm one and on. Baby, come and show me. Take my heart, I never thought I, I could love this hard. Oh, I can't get enough. Mm -hmm. You got me feeling like you got me. All right, tan. First coat of tan is complete. And at the arena and we're just gonna go back to the hotel to rest and then I have another meal in I don't know like an hour and a bit so it's nice and warm out here holy my toes are numb
hello. It is about 8.15 ish. So I'm just cooking up my food. Um, I had a really quick four ounces of coffee, which was allotted to me. So just gonna do that. And then I'm gonna eat. And then in like an hour or so, I will update the coach. muffin and then I'll take pictures for coach and then wait another two hour and a half before I have to go back to the arena and I'll take you with me. <laughs> Hand up, got my makeup done, and now I'm gonna go eat because I'm hungry. Back at the hotel, here's a little better look at me face. How I do this. She did a really good job. I'm really happy with it. Um, it's definitely darker eyes than I would do, but why not? All right, hair done, makeup done. We are just doing our last, probably our last meal or like full meal before the show. Um, it's about, it is two o'clock and I am to be probably backstage around just after four. So I'll start to head over there probably at four. And then that way I can, um, it's like a five minute drive to the venue. It's very, very close. So I'll get there at like 4.15 by the time I park and am in, in the building and I'll find a cozy little spot in the back to set up camp. Um, I'll have like my bag of stuff. Um, I'll bring a pillow with a pillowcase so that I have something to lay on. Um, just feed up and wait. Uh, we're the second category on, I believe it's, I think it was like master's figure and then us. I think there's only master's figure, I'm not sure. But I'm feeling good. I don't know what to expect. Um, some of these girls are really gunning for the Olympia, uh, Olympia qualification. And I'm just here because it's already been paid for. So we're, we're just here for fun. It's paid for, so I don't mean to sound demure about it, but I just, it wasn't a great season. And so I'm going into today because I've never been to Mississippi. Um, I really like competing and I like the improvements that I've made from the Tampa Pro Show. So I'm just hoping I get rewarded in some way. So wish me luck. My makeup looks fire though. Holy. Might have to get fillers next year, but mmm, 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 girl.
pop up room very early, so I'll be sitting here for like an hour and a half. That's okay. Just got a pre judging and an unexpected first call. I don't think I deserve it. I just didn't expect it. Um, so, fourth, fifth, maybe sixth, but in the first call, no less. So, I'll be able to do my routine this evening. So, I'm going to have a little bit of coffee, a couple of rice cakes now, and rest up probably for about an hour at least, or maybe more. I don't really know. That's like a pack of that Mexican coffee, instant coffee, and like this much water, <laughs> and then a dandelion root tea bag. Oh, it's very strong. So I have, I took a swig of the Gatorade, which I'll also have when I'm pumping up later. Uh, I've had rice cake with some salt, and yeah, that's what I'll have. My pop up. I also have some Reese cups, which I find a jump of sugar is good last minute, so I'm gonna do that as well. But overall, that was very surprising. Um, I appreciate them uh, seeing my shape. I know I'm still not the biggest, so that's for off season, but right now I'm number 48. Well, holy shit, we just made a crazy, sorry, my hardware. We just made a crazy comeback, homies. So two weekends ago in Tampa, I got spanked, like spanked. Where was I? I got spanked in Tampa and I just came fifth. Top call out at the Tupelo Pro. Mm. Mm. Salty caramel. I'm not usually a salty caramel person, but it sounded really good. So I sped over, sped over to Five Guys because they closed at um, 10 o'clock. And it was like 9.40 when I got there. So all I wanted was a little burger, There we go. All I wanted was just a little burger with some bacon, not even any cheese on it, um, and some french fries. I wanted fucking french fries. So, hmm, just to recap, I did not, you kind of saw my attitude before. I did not really think, I thought this show was gonna be a total like, another spanking. Because as soon as I saw, the list come out, it was like basically all the same girls. Sugar free ketchup. All the same girls at the show again that were there. Yeah. Um, and so I, I just wanna eat so badly right now. I thought I was just gonna end up in last call it again. So I am so grateful that they saw me and they thought I improved. I'm still gonna email the judge, head judge. She was wonderful. She worked all of us, even the other girls and the other call outs. She was moving them all around, which is exactly what you're supposed to do. You don't just like see your lineup, pick out your top three and let, like, let them be the winners. Like let everyone work. We spent months dieting and spent a ton of money to get there. So like, let us work. Like, even if it's the illusion that we're putting, being pit up against other people, whatever. So she was wonderful. Her name was Mo. It was like Mary something, O something. 
Um, I'll figure it out, but she was great. And when we got to do our routine, so the top 10 only do their routine, um, she actually paid attention and like the, the three guys there with her paid attention to the routines. I don't think I've ever done a routine where they're like, oh yeah, and like whispering, whispering, like analyzing what the people were doing. So that felt great. Um, I will say because I did not predict that I would be in a competitive placing this show, I definitely didn't practice my routine or even some of my posing as much as I probably should have. So that's a lesson. I try to find lessons in everything. Oh, like where I could have done better. So that was my lesson. Never assume because different judges look for different things. And you know, some girls who beat me a fuck ton, a fart ton two weeks ago, I was right neck and neck with them. So I'm pretty proud. Um, like I said, race to five guys, got a lot of French fries. I really just wanted French fries. And I just got a, a single, oh, he did give me cheese. I didn't want cheese, but that's okay. But jalapenos, that was the big, the big, uh, big, whatever change. Hmm. Mmm. With the jalapenos. I just want a bacon. I am so happy. Mmm. So tomorrow, day off or whatever. Free day is what I meant to say. Mmm. So, I'm gonna go work out. I have a photo shoot. And. I'm gonna go to barbecue and visit the Elvis Presley Museum. So anyway, that is the culmination of my show day vlog. It like had pits and peaks there, kept you guessing. So thank you so much for following along this entire season. This is the culmination of my 2024 season and we ended with the medal. So I'm pretty happy. Thank you so much for following along. Please continue to follow along. I'm gonna continue this into my off season because I've got big plans. The feedback that I've gotten from these uh, shows and even last year's shows was put on more size. So mm, we gotta put on more size guys. So thank you. I am really proud of this medal. I worked really hard and I didn't stop. Um, I got leaner, I improved. So thanks for following guys. Good buddy of mine. Um, he owns a couple, maybe three locations now, two or three locations. The gym's called Hidden Gym. Mm. And they just opened another location. There's so almost too much icing. After our breakfast. And we are going to do, I can't even, I can't even forget this. Full day of eating. Full day of eating. Post show. We're going to take you guys through, show you everything that we're doing, and eating, all the fun stuff, because the, sh the season's over, shows are over, this is going to be great, the boys and I and Lex are going to smash some food, stay tuned. Uh, we're good. Yeah. <laughs>